go. Let's go. Let's go. Man, they doubted us. They said the Giants were going to come in here and beat us. And look at that. Look at that. I knew it. I knew it. I, I, I wasn't worried. I mean, I was a little nervous. But holy smokes. We just said, and literally just won the whole thing. Like, we just destroyed them the entire time. They had no chance after the first quarter. Zero. Man, I'm so happy right now. Holy moly. That's so, that's so tough. All right, let's start off with some, some of the stuff. First of all, perfect play calling. Perfect. We ran the ball a lot. And J Jalen didn't even get in it in like many like bad tackles. Gainwell went off. Sanders went off. Scott went off. We had more combined rushing yards between them three than the Giants had their entire team. And they said the Giants were going to come in here and beat us. Jeez, bro. Danny Dimes was trash. I mean, we contained him. He ran a little, but nothing, nothing even close to what he did last week. He could, he had like, I don't even know how many yards he had, but like, it was just, it was just like trash time yards. But um, play calling it was insane. Jalen looked great and protected his shoulder. I'm so happy, so happy that he was fine. Um, it was such a relief to see that, and now he can rest up. And we're still staying in Philly, don't even have to travel. Um, so tomorrow will be very interesting to see who we're going to play. But, oh my goodness, it just it just got me like so excited. Like, I don't know how to say it, but this team right here, they're going to be hard to beat no matter who we're playing. I don't care who it is. I mean, Dallas, San Fran, it doesn't matter. If we play like that, it does not matter at all who we play next week. How about the coverage of the secondary? They had one blown play, but he dropped it, so it didn't matter. The pressure on Daniel Jones was caused by the coverage on most plays. Coverage sacks were there. Offensively, like I said, the play calling was perfect. <sighs> Big blue, more like I saw something that said mini blue. I mean, like, give, I'll give credit where it's due. The Giants had a good year. Uh, no one was really expecting this, to be fair. But, um, wow. <laughs> Jeez, bro. Giants fans. It's, I knew it was going to come to an end tonight. Um, good game, I guess. Uh, I, now I want to talk a little bit about the game tomorrow. Uh, Cowboys Niners. Um, I think I think it's going to be really close for a while. And then I feel like the Niners defense is going to take over. And they're going to win. They're going to pull away in end of the third quarter-ish. Um, that's my prediction for tomorrow. But I'll, I might drop another video on that, that separately. But holy smokes. That defense. That defense. Garner Johnson was making tackle after tackle, making great hits. Blankenship had a good game. He has been great. Um, the linebackers did well. Reddick is everywhere. Hassan Reddick is everywhere on every play. He's just always there. It doesn't even matter. Like, it was like a punt. It doesn't matter if it's a run. It doesn't matter if it's a pass. It just doesn't matter. He is just an absolute stud. And I really, really hope we get him back. Um, but this feels great to win. Uh, to blow them out like this is just it's so satisfying um wow i know i'm a loss for words but what a win let's go uh moving on next sunday at 3 p.m i think is the nfc championship and i think i have really really good uh really good feeling about it right now no matter who we're playing um but, whew, what an all-around performance i'm proud whew, so happy all right, guys, make sure to subscribe, uh, like the video. Uh, let me know what you guys think, like, thought in the comments of the game. Uh, who do you, who you guys rather play the next round? Um, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.